Hello everyone, it's Sue from Hold On and Enjoy the Ride. And today I'm gonna to be working on March 6th through the March 12th. And this is a special week for me this week. This is um, the week that my youngest son, Matthew, turns 25. So I'm gonna do a happy birthday layout in his honor. I got these stickers at Hobby Lobby a few days ago. It's the Paper Studio. I really like them because they're black and gold and I wanted to do a black and gold layout for his birthday. So that's why I picked these up and I'm going to use some stickers in this seasonal happy planner and probably a couple of stickers here and there from a couple other happy planners that will coordinate with this. So let's get going. Oh, also I have this picture that I printed out. It's two by three and it's on sticky paper so you just peel off the backing and it sticks. It's from my new printer that I got. It's the HP Sprocket and look at this. It's that small. It fits in the palm of my hand. Isn't that awesome? And it prints out these two by three inch pictures which is perfect because it comes out and has the stickiness on the back already. You put it right down on your planner, right on your memory planner, on your scrapbook, wherever you want to put it. So awesome. I just love it. I just got this and I love it and it couldn't have been easier to put together. I have a video that um, if it didn't come out before this video, it's going to come out the very next day. A full review on the printer and a little bit more information about it and the price and so forth. So. If I didn't already post it, it means it's going to probably post the day after this video, so keep your eye out. Okay, so let's get going. Let's get the party started. See what I did there? Party, birthday spread. Okay, so I have a page that I had marked. Here we go that has a lot of great birthday stickers that have gold and black in it, or just gold, or just black, and I just thought that would coordinate nicely. So I'm gonna use some of these. So I'm gonna use the sticker, It's Time to Celebrate, out of the Seasonal Happy Planner, and I'm gonna put it over here. And I don't know why I always find it easier to turn the page upside down and do the sticker this way. And I know there's little dots underneath and they show through, but in a way I'm gonna think of it as confetti. Is that straight? It's a little crooked. Okay, can I pull this up safely? Yeah, I can. This one's going very, very nicely it's coming up. Very good. So let me try this again, but now of course it's all rolling into itself. Makes it a little harder. I'm gonna leave that up a little bit because what I was gonna do is I was gonna peel this off. My nails are so short today I had two of them break down really low, so when I had my nails done, I had them just cut them really short, but now it's harder to get up under things, you know? So I think I'm gonna put this here and overlap it, what do you think? I wanted to mat this, but it just didn't look right on black paper, and I don't have gold paper, and I don't know what else to mat it on, because I, I know there's a couple other colors being brought in from here, but pretty much the whole page is gonna be black and gold, so I don't wanna do a different color. So I'm just gonna put it down without it being matted. And I don't know how well these things come up once they go down, so. Oop, not too bad. But I figure I might as well make it a little bit on this line. Okay, 
Let's go this way. His birthday is actually the 9th, so I'm going to use this. I'm really having trouble with my nails this short. There it goes. I'm going to put the happy birthday over here. Also going to use out of the bold and bright sticker some of these black confetti looking stickers here because they have some nice ones that could go down the side okay note to self the nails are too short there it goes wow Okay, hmm. Yeah, that'll work up there. I could get that around the the numbers, I think. Yeah, you could still see them. rate it's taken me to get these stickers off the page. It's going to take me a couple hours to get this page done. Hmm. So for those of you that went to Go Wild, it looked like it was a fabulous time, and I really, really am jelly that I didn't get to go. But I'm definitely planning on it for next year. Uh-oh. You know what? I'm not going to put these down here. That is if I could get them off nicely, which they're doing. They're coming off. Yay. Don't roll up. Don't roll up. put it on this page. So unfortunately, my son will not be home for his birthday. He'll be up in Tallahassee. He has school at that time. And then his spring break starts a couple days after, and he is going to New York City with his friends, which, good for him. Got to enjoy life. I'm jealous about that, too. <laughs> I'm jealous of all you that went to Washington, D.C. for Go Wild, and I'm jealous he's going to New York City, but that's okay. It's okay. Everybody's got to go have some fun sometimes. I'm going on my trip in July, so I can't be greedy. I'm going to do some of these gold, it looks like paint splatters, but I think they're going to be cool. How cool is that? There was a cut out there, perfect. I'm not even covering up the hole there. How awesome is that?
And then I have from the black and white Happy Planner book some stickers that have that kind of confetti-ish look, so I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna put it over here to cover where it says this week's tasks. And then I'm gonna use this note paper that also has that same gold look and I'm just gonna overlay it on this one a little bit. I could use that to write a list of ideas of gifts for him, but I'm not gonna write it on here because if he sees this video, no listening, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> he's so good I always say did you see my video and he says yes I got the notification he's so sweet so what else are we going to do I guess we have to put the best day ever sticker over here on the 9th it is one of my best days ever. The day he was born, the day my other son was born, and my wedding. So I guess those are the best days ever. Try to center it in this. Sometimes when I'm really trying to concentrate, I know I got those lines under there. I get quiet, putting all my energy into my vision. Why is that? Why do people do that? Why do you get so focused that you can't, you can't talk and focus on something at the same time? It's kind of like when you're in a car and it's pouring down rain so hard that you turn the radio down because it's like you're going to be able to see better in the rain with the radio down. I don't know. It's just odd, but yeah, I get I get silent sometimes here. I'm sorry. I'm in deep deep concentration. I think I'm pushing my luck with a sticker. That's what I think. Okay. That'll work. Best day ever. It says, happy birthday to you, and it's got the arrow pointing that way. So what do you think? I think we, I was gonna put it right on this line, but then the arrow's kind of going above the picture. I don't know, I still might do it that way, because, because why not? Put this box over here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put this box sticker there that's gold and black.
I have to tell you, I am really struggling with these stickers, getting them off the page. I'm gonna put a couple of boxes some other places. Is that crooked? That is crooked. I think that's better. Okay, so I know that there's an appointment on Monday. Too much concentration again, I'm getting quiet. I usually film earlier in the day and it's late evening now. I think I'm starting to get a little tired, which could go two ways. Either I get tired and I get quiet or I get tired and I get punchy. And then I start talking too much. Oh my goodness. Somebody get these stickers off for me. Oh my goodness. Oh, shit. Lord. Make a wish. Hooray down here. I had originally gotten this, the numbers two and five, to do a 25 on the page, but it's thicker. And I started thinking, as cool as it would be to have on the page, it might make the planner pages warp or bulge in that area. So I said to myself, well, I better not. So scrap that idea. some balloons, although that light blue balloon, I need to do a little bit of whiting out of it. my contacts in and I guess because I've had them on all day it's been quite a long time everything is starting to like look a little bit blurry there's 
starting to irritate my eyes. I'm put some little pieces of confetti around over here in this area. Going to put a little sticker here that says, You are so very loved. Okay. this part off a little bit right here. There. Okay, this says big plans. I don't like it there. The blacks don't match there. But it could go down here. I'm not liking this here. I need a scalpel. Oh, okay. It's ripping the paper a little. I'm gonna have to put something over it. This is complicated surgery. Not too bad. A little bit there, but not too bad. I'm going to put this there. Okay, what else do I want to use?
The struggle is real with these stickers. These stickers are really hard to get out. That is crooked. Why am I having such trouble making these straight? I think this arrow here is throwing me off. But it's throwing me off for sure. I guess that one's straight. That one I need to fix. <laughs> I think it's just as crooked as it was, maybe even more so. You hear all those motorcycles? I don't know if you guys could hear it. it sounds like there's some motorcycles drag racing out there. How could one little sticker be so much problems? It still looks a little crooked, but you know what? I'm gonna let it go. Gonna let it go. Gonna let it go. Let's eat cake. Cake sounds good. I'm not doing cake right now. No cake for me. Reminds me of that episode of Seinfeld. No soup for you. No soup for me, no cake for me. I am still on a diet. Put one of these here as well on my weekend list. It's a little crooked too. 
How does that nursery rhyme go? There lived a little, uh, there was a crooked little woman who lived in a crooked little shoe. Am I making this up or is it a real thing? Because I'm, I'm starting to get so tired, I'm getting punchy now. And now I might be making up nursery rhymes that don't even exist. But no, I can't even let that go. I was gonna let that go, I can't let it go. Is there really a nursery rhyme like that? If I remember when I'm done with this video, I'm gonna have to do a Google search. It's been a long time since I've read nursery rhymes. I don't know, that's, that's not any better. <laughs> oh my goodness. I am definitely, note to self, videos are better for you in the morning. You're white, you're awake. I can't even speak anymore. I'm awake in the morning. I see clear. I am just getting tired and punchy. Okay, please tell me that's straight. Well, it's as straight as it's gonna be. I'm gonna do a couple more of these little paint splatter looking things around. That'll work. Okay, I think I'm gonna use one more sticker. And I think I'm gonna use this one. Okay now, Matthew, if you're watching, it says surprise. Doesn't mean you're getting a surprise party. You're not even gonna be around. You're going to New York. Dang line showing through again. The lines are getting me tonight. Okay. There. All fixed. All right. Still need a 25. I've got to have number stickers somewhere. Let me look for a book that has numbers in it. I know I have one. I know I have one. Found some planner basics. Look at that. So cool. Now where am I going to put it? Where am I going to put it? Down here on the 9th on his birthday in this little area? Or somewhere up here because it looks a little blank. I think it needs to go here. Yeah. 
I think it needs to go there. You guys aren't talking loud enough for me to hear where you think it should go, so I have no choice. It's going there. 25. Although, well, I guess 125 is enough per page, right? Because I could do the two and the five and put one somewhere else. Is one time enough? Should I do two? There is another 25, how? There's several 25s. Look at that. I could do another one. You can tell I haven't been in that planner, that sticker book too much. I don't know, I think these are like paint splatters, but I'm gonna say it's gold confetti flying through the air in celebration of his birthday. That's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm gonna believe. Okay, I was trying to act like this didn't bother me that I overlapped onto my Celebrate, but it is bothering me. So, I'm gonna move it over if I can. Oh, come on now, come on. Okay, so maybe if I just cut that candle out. Not so easy to do when it's already on the paper. I don't know if it made much of a difference to anybody else, but I like it a little better. I don't know if you could hear it. My mother lives with us. She's 83 years old. She's downstairs in her bedroom with the door shut. And she loves classic rock. And she is down there and she can't hear that well. So her music is always pretty loud. I'm up the stairs and down the hall. And I could hear her song playing very clearly. And I don't know if you could hear it too. But right now, I think it's Led Zeppelin. What's that song title? I don't know. Is it called A Big Leg A Big Legged Woman Ain't Got No Soul is the words that I'm hearing. Is that the name? I don't know. I usually know names of songs, but I don't I don't know if that's the right name. But that's playing right now. So I don't know if you hear it. If you do, it's my 83-year-old mo mother downstairs rocking away. <laughs> it's crazy. Every night. She likes to listen to her classic rock and she plays um, 
mahjong on the um, computer. So that's how she likes to enjoy her evening. I don't know, I think maybe I might be done. I think I might be done. I have some room to write in different places. I think I need a little something there. Maybe I'll put some of this confetti stuff there. Just looked a little too plain Jane. So anyway, don't forget to keep an eye out for the video that I'm doing on, on this little mini printer. It's the sprocket. Pretty cool. I think I'm going to enjoy it. Now that I finally got it, I'm going to have to um, catch up on my memory planning because it's just going to be so much easier to print out pictures from that than to sit there and have the full-size picture and constantly chop them down. Who's got time for that? Not me. Thanks for watching my video. I hope that you liked it. If you did, please hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel as well. And leave me a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. Hope you guys have a great week ahead. Have a great day. Bye-bye.